Howdy guys, welcome back to Metroid Prime 3. I'm shooting like crazy, but my Phazon beam is not running out. Why is that? Well, maybe because we need to do this in Hyperball. Boom, boom. The upgrade we just picked up in the previous video is Hyperball. And it looks like that really is Hyper Mode. We're still, I've still done this before. So, oh, God. Whoa, look at that. Oh, jeez. It's like a butthole. Well, there's your seed. Normally the seed comes out the other end, not the butthole, but okay. Sam's is like, I'm gonna get you after all the shit you put me through. What am I doing? I'm going into lens flare mode, that's what I'm doing. Press A to release phase on energy toward the core. Well, it's core, I hate to break it to you, but you're about to get schlamoozled. Oh, man. <laughs> Samus doesn't even wait around to watch. She's just like, fuck this. I'm out of here. And who says Nintendo can't be badass? I'm telling you, man. Oh, man. Look at it. When you first look at that, it looks so big and doom train impending. Doom train impending. Wonderful. But, and then someone as small as Samus can just go in there and... You're welcome. Okay. The impact point is hidden deep within the storm clouds of this planet. You will not be able to reach its location. Mm, yeah, I figured as much. Because I actually went there. You may land near an automated research facility floating high above the surface, where GF Aurora Unit 217 is stationed. Unit 217 has been infected by the corruption virus and is currently offline. I have uploaded a program to your suit that will purge any traces of corruption in the AU and restore its functionality. Okay. That's all I've said is oh. has been restored. It will help us find a way to destroy the Leviathan. We are concerned about Gore ever since he lost contact with us. We hope he is safe. Good luck, Samus. You hope he is safe. Do you even know what hope is? You're a machine. You don't know what hope is. But okay, whatever. It's like I said, I've been to Elysia before. I went there just to check it out when I was practicing, but obviously I couldn't do anything there, so I haven't seen much of it. But when I was there, it reminded me a lot of the impact crater in the first game. I don't know, something about the hallways. The way they went back and forth and just, let's just do this, man. One section is all we have so far, that's good enough for me. <laughs> the less we have to explore, the better, but then again... Well, I can't believe I'm even saying that in a Metroid game. But okay. So, Alicia is going to be a little bit bigger than her sister, Brio. Whoa, man. Is that a planet, or is that the sun? Oh... Well, how Skyward Sword is this, huh? I saw a city in the clouds. This definitely does remind me of Cloud City a little bit. <clears throat> uh, hello. Is your voice crack there? So yeah, like I said, I've been here already for once, but I couldn't do anything, so... I'm guessing the Hyperball is what I'm gonna have to do. Since that's what I just picked up. Oh, I never went back for that energy tank. Mm. I don't care. We'll do it. Let's see. What kind of stuff will we get to scan out here? Oh, I like the music. Man, it's very Final Fantasy esque. <laughs> 
Boom. Oh, got a message? Your highest priority is to get Skytown's Aurora unit back online. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, I can scan while they're talking to me here. Hang on. Well, the whereabouts I can handle. The disposition, on the other hand, yeah. <laughs> after what happened with Rundus. Okay. Well, that's not so bad. We have no way of knowing how far that really is, though. But it's a video game. They wouldn't make it, you know. It's like best case scenario, worst case scenario, any case scenario, whatever. Aerial repair drone, automated maintenance bot, initial activation 132 years ago. So this guy has been working since 1885. Is that right? 15 plus 16 is 31 and 100 is 131. Oh, that was close. Well, I said 1885 because of Back to the Future. Anyway, rest in peace, little guy. You've worked hard enough. What is that? Oh, it's probably a ship missile drop. Better than a ship missile drop, I guess, even though it probably sounded like I said the same thing there. Let's come around the hallway here, and we have... Blue dots. Yeah, see, this is, reminds me of the impact crater. It's kind of weird. Ugh. That's gross. Just attacking the brother on the phase on base weaponry. Well, there you go. <laughs> okay, I screwed that up. I don't know what I was thinking there, but. <laughs> I mean, first I tried bombs, and I remember. I mean, I just said it earlier the hyperball, you just got that power. That's probably the next thing you have to use. I mean, it's kind of hard to be excited about something when it's so... Well, whatever. I, I was trying to quote Sequelitis, but I kind of messed it up. Uh, let's see here. Well, I don't know. Uh, oh, I see a quick shot thing up there. Okay. Okay. Uh, can I shoot this? I have to be able to do something here. So like it. Oh, here we go. Okay. <laughs> Nothing a little charts a shot can't handle. What was that? What was that? Kind of glad that didn't explode. Whatever it was. Anyway. Oh man. Skytown Alicia. Obviously taking a great deal of inspiration from Sky Sanctuary in Prime Two. Well, this is a little different because it's more daytime, like, you know, the, um, what is it, the, uh, oh god, seriously, you just said it, Sanctuary, you know, looks like it was over a nighttime sky, mostly, if I remember right, maybe not, <laughs> yeah, I don't know, what is this, this is like a rail, we're gonna have to, oh dear, oh dear, oh, 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 oh look the right way, okay, whoa, there was something over there, oh, this little C-3PO things, Okay. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah. Boom. Oh, jeez, oh, oh, I almost missed that one. Oh, this is so cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. So much ooh, man. Oh, that was so cool. Man, look at this. I think I would actually sleep out here, man. Oh. Just when you think they run out of biomes, you know? Oh, great. It's the attack of the clones, droids. Now, well, let's see just how much of a pain in Oh, wow. These guys aren't a pain at all. One charge shot. <laughs> so they're pretty much as powerful as they were in the movie. Go figure. Whoa, did I just get a jump there? <laughs> no, I think I just double jumped. Oh, man. Okay, there's the thing down there. 
platform up there, and then there's like... Oh, oh man, that guy just went flying. So do I want to go up or down here? I'm gonna go down. Whichever way I go, like one way is forward, the other way is obviously something else. Flying Scorpion? Oh, gee, there's tons of stuff in here. Battery units connected to holographic projection disc. Units offline in need of repairs. Well, isn't everything these days. Flying <laughs> projector is high. This guy tells me network. Gore's image is displayed. Oh, no. What do you mean by that? What's going on in the picture? I mean, is there just a picture of him smiling there? Did they get his high school yearbook picture? To just broadcast it over their network to say, you know, hey, if you know this guy, you better back away. We will not have anything to do with you. Any attempt to contact will be met with fierce resistance. Oh, wait, look at that. Um, hang on. <laughs> I was trying to scan. I used the wrong button there. Okay, now it's the map from The Force Awakens. Here we go. Oh, I don't think I got that. Let me try it again. Missing data decoded. Data moved to logbook for review. Oh boy. Uh, I don't know what kind of voice I want to use for this. Maybe just not. Chozo? Pushing the stairways began to make control on the station, and upkeep began to take up more and more of their precious time. Seeing any resistance that created us, the first Elysian. Oh boy. Better assist the creators. The first was given self awareness to all other Elysians. The first shared the Chozo gift. The first. What is this, Buffy the Vampire Slayer? Anyway, no. <laughs> How many references can we make here? Well, I mean, The Force Awakens is not really a fair comparison given that that came out like 15 years after this game did. No, it wasn't 15 years. It's more like 8 years. Anyway. Piston Honda structure produces energy that knocks down Little Mac. Thank you for that. Holograph projector, Gore's images display. Dude, stop showing me that. I don't want to see it. God, what if he's like getting tortured or something and they're showing that? I didn't say what kind of an image it was. Like you could see an image of somebody you know, it could be any kind of image. He's just sitting there all dead. Oh, so we have a kinetic orb cannon here. Wait, let's see. Cam systems online, okay. Let's see what else is out here. Doesn't seem like anything, okay. Here we go. <laughs> oh! Whoa, man! It's a good thing those cannons work so well. You can just drop me off into the sky and let me. Left me to fall for nothing, so we got a morph ball passage. Don't see much else here, so away we go. Oh wow. Um, <laughs> well, that was easy. Ba -doo -ba -doo. I just find it a little deceiving that they made that so obvious. It's almost like they wanted you to find it or something. Hmm. Man, I got some hand soap the other day. And I don't know what, like, the smell of it takes me back to somewhere, and I can't think of where. I can't think of what other time in my life I smelled that, but man. I'll tell ya. Okay, what exactly is over here? Alright, what is this? No, you're using the wrong button again. <laughs> Let's figure it out. Scans detect the alloys within this metal are vulnerable to heat. High temp shots could melt it. Then, more of this. Oh, here we go again. Let's get ready to shoot anything that comes our way. I don't know what. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. No, no. Oh, 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 God. Oh. It must be such a long way down. That's not. That's so not fair that I can just do this again. I mean, in real life, if you screwed that up, then that's it. I mean, it's over. Like, everything for you is over. Everything you've ever done in your life is over at that point. 
you know, but in the game, it's just, oh, start again, you know, no problem. I have this weird thing, like, sometimes I wonder if, like, when you die in real life, you don't actually die, but you just, like, respawn. <laughs> I know that sounds so dumb, but, like, you don't know, you wouldn't know the difference if you did. If your memory was erased or set back to the point. I mean, who knows, maybe that's what dreams are. Okay. Well, scan. Security systems engaged. Contact with activated energy beams will result in injury. <laughs> no shit. Alright, what's the deal here? Is there like a switch in here somewhere? Hmm. There's a box. Not what I'm looking for. Oh, there's another one of you. Let's put you out of your misery. I don't know, these little robots kind of seem a little benevolent. I mean, they're not hurting anybody. Can I go under it? There's a switch on the wall. There's like two on this side. Or, well, I thought I saw two earlier. No, there's two on that side, yeah. Here we go. And then one on, well... I don't know if I can interact with him in any way. Let me just see if I can go under it. Oh. You can just walk over it. You're scum. Anyway, no, whatever. <laughs> Alright. Handprint identification, please. Ooh, can I go back there? Let me see. What's back here? It's kind of like Banjo Tooie. You can see through the window to the AC vent. All these elevators are so freaky. Like all the holographic, you know, shields around you. Okay, where are we going now? Oh, good lord. I almost got smooshed. It would have been a Samus pancake. With syrup. I prefer syrup. Whoa, whoa, there's something up there. So, oh, those must be spider ball tracks. I'm totally convinced there's a spider ball in this game. There may not be, I don't know. Nothing there. Dead ends. I'm telling you, man, any seasoned Metroid player knows better than to take for granted that something is a dead end. So you don't know, man. Okay, there's something in here. I smell a rat. I smell two rats, actually. Hmm. Well, when all else fails, I suppose we... Shoot. I don't know. Well, I guess just leave. Oh, well, there you go. That's what I had to do. I had to leave. <laughs> I had to try to leave. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Look at the way they're walking. Oh, they're so stiff. Like Christopher Lloyd when he runs up to the hospital in that one scene in the Dream Team, although I know you're not. There's no way in hell you know which scene I'm talking about. It's like towards the end of the movie. Okay, these guys are a little tougher. I might not have to know these. I'm not gonna do it just yet. Let's see. Man, check out this music, man. Oh, she's bringing him back to life. That is a she, is it not? <laughs> I don't know. Since when do we assign gender to droids? I don't know. I'm doing it. You are going down. Oh, she disappeared. Okay, use it on something else. Let me use it all up. Let me wait for it to regenerate here a little bit. Well, and all the time that I'm regenerating, so are they. So, <laughs> it may not be the smartest thing. Chew, chew. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. You're cool. Fuck you, I'm out. That last fuck you was so. so angry. Uh. Okay, this thing doesn't have a life bar, whatever it is. Let's try something this one's here. Oh, oh, Jesus, if you stop missing, Tim. Seriously, now. 
Okay, so we are, I didn't mention it, but we are officially blind here, like, now. It's pretty much everything I'm doing from here on out. I don't know what's coming. I'm just gonna, just gonna I think I'm just gonna blast her this. I'm just gonna blast her this. Because we have two direct objects in the end of our sentences now. I bought two tickets. You are going dead. Oh, yeah! Okay, that was a little bit easier than I thought. Energy tank? Well, I'll take an energy tank, hell yeah. Steam Lord defeated, I thought that was a Steam Lord S. Well... What do we got in here? Might as well scan this, since we haven't yet. Vertical traversal unit, hmm. That looks like a lever. Okay. We can actually, well, you know what? We should pick up the energy tank, I guess. <laughs> Before I forget, you know, Lord knows I'm gonna walk out of here and leave it sitting there. I wonder what would actually happen if I did that. Like, would it still be there when I got back, or I don't know. I don't know. Okay, there's a few of these. Whoops. Try that again. <laughs> All right. The way forward has been opened. And now we have four energy tanks instead of three, which is definitely... Like, if I had picked up that other energy tank, hypothetically, you'd be looking at five instead of four, which is not as big of a deal as four instead of three. Okay, I guess I need to... Activate a lift here. Okay. Pretty standard, but what if I kept going, though? It's over there. I wanna know! I need to know! <laughs> oh, that's so beautiful. This reminds me a little bit of, like, this level in Spyro I played once. Spyro with Heroes Tale. It's the only Spyro game I've ever played. I rented it like 10 years ago. Sometimes I have these random flashbacks of it, but I can barely remember like any of it. Anyway, lift time! Crunch time! No, no. No crunch time for you. More shit. More shite. Oh, uh, what is... whoa. Oh, it's just one of those. <laughs> Couldn't tell, he was kind of blending into the background. I thought I'd stumbled on a semi-invisible enemy here. Boy, oh boy. The mind does play tricks, does it not? Same old thing here. Here we go again. Whee! <laughs> uh oh, they're changing it up. Um, shit! Okay. Three of you, huh? Gonna spell it out. Man, who even knows where we're going here? Oh my god, this is like dizzying. Ugh, it's a good thing I'm not looking at the background. But rather, you know, what's happening right in front of me. It's another one of these. It doesn't look like I can fit in that. <laughs> what even is that? Is this like another one of those seeker missile gizmos. Safety cap is blocking access and you can it shot simultaneously. Okay, yeah, it is. Still. Almost looks like the fuel gel things too. Anyway, whatever. Up there? Nothing? Anything else we can scan out here? I love this place. Man, this is really cool. You guys weren't kidding. Good game. We got a good game on our hands here. Hell yeah. <laughs> Of course, just about every game is, is good in some way. Repair drone, ground-based automated drone. Once well, used for maintenance. That's what repair is. It's the lift system. Mm-hmm. Whack, whack, whack. It's another one of these panels here. I feel like I was just in this room. <laughs> I wasn't, right? Okay, no, I wasn't, because of this over here. 
Oh, save point? Are you serious right now? We were like right there though. Huh. It's two little things over there. You know what? I think we're actually going to uh, stop here. And in the next episode, we will save and go to the next room. See, what's, see what awaits us. So take care, you guys. See you next time. And goodbye. Or see you after PAX East, I guess. I don't actually know. Like, um, I have a lot of Plants vs. Zombies videos done because I played all the way through the end of the Frostbite Caves. So most of what goes up between now and and now and when I get back from PAX is probably going to be Plants vs. Zombies. And this might, this may or may not be the last Prime video. I'm not sure yet. Depends on how things go, but we'll see. Anyway, shut up. We're down here. Take care. Good lord. Heavens to Betsy. There are more airplanes in the ocean than there are submarines in the sky. Don't forget that.